south on the freeway overnight when he heard the gunshots and then realized he'd been shot. Soon after, the victim spotted a Detroit police officer and stopped for help. Victor Williams has been following this story all day for us. And Victor, that man now in critical condition. Yes, in critical condition, and this is a very scary situation. For a few moments, it felt like the lodge was a battlefield with gunshots ringing out from one car to the other. The lodge freeway was closed for hours just after 1 a.m. Thursday morning as Michigan State Troopers searched for evidence regarding a shooting that placed a young man in the hospital. It's pretty rare that somebody's just driving down the road and somebody shoots at their car. Usually there's something that occurred before then and that's what we're trying to figure out now. Lieutenant Mike Shaw says there must be some reason as to why someone decided to fire shots at a 22 year old driver and a woman in a passenger seat on the busy freeway. They were driving southbound on the lodge near the Davison uh, when a vehicle went by them and fired several shots into their car. Uh, one of the shots hit the driver. Somehow the passenger was able to take the wheel switching places with the driver and the two were able to flag down an officer assisting with an accident on Davison and Wildemere. The 22 year old victim was then rushed to the hospital where he's currently being treated for injuries. But still there may be more to this incident than what we know at the exact moment. Uh, we don't have just people getting shot on, on the freeways in Detroit uh, for no reason. There's always some backstory to it. Um, they may not even know there's a backstory. They may have offended somebody or you know, the big word that we always hear is disrespected somebody. Uh, something may have occurred to that, of, that effect and we just don't know it yet. And the shooting is still under investigation. A little bit of good news, though. The passenger, she was not harmed at all. Reporting live on the lodge, Victor Williams, Local 4. All right, Victor, thanks.